Small acreage livestock farms are often family owned and operated. Small farms provide benefits to the community by practicing environmental stewardship of the land and water. There are some key points to understand about water and how our actions can impact water quality. There are two main types of water, groundwater and surface water. Groundwater is water that is held underground by soil or spaces in rocks. Groundwater is everywhere, but the depth to that groundwater varies. Surface water, on the other hand, is water that collects above the ground, or more simply, water that we can see with our eyes. Think ponds, lakes, rivers, or the ocean. This all comes together in a watershed, which is an area of land that drains all the streams, rainfall, and surface water to a common point. Groundwater and surface water are interconnected. When it rains or snows, groundwater and surface water are recharged. Activity on your property can affect surface water and groundwater, either negatively or positively. Over 60% of Rhode Islanders get their drinking water from the Citroën Reservoir. A reservoir is a natural or man-made body of surface water that is used as a drinking water supply. Protecting the reservoir's watershed, our watershed, is critical to the health and quality of our drinking water and the environment. Whether you have well water or you get your water from the city, you can help reduce pollution risk to water resources in the watershed. Activity on your property impacts the quality and health of our drinking water and the environment. With regards to farms, it is our responsibility to be mindful of the manure and how we manage it. Manure management is an opportunity for you to improve water quality. Animal waste can contain pathogens and excess nutrients that affect the health of humans, animals, and the environment. Microorganisms and pathogens such as Salmonella, E. coli, protozoa, and parasitic worms are viruses that can cause disease. Humans and animals can contract these pathogens by consuming contaminated water and then spread it to others. Nutrient pollution is an excess of nutrients in the water, mainly nitrogen and phosphorus, that can cause human and animal health issues as well as environmental degradation. Nitrogen and phosphorus are natural elements that are found in water, manure, and fertilizers. At high levels, Excess nitrogen in your drinking water can cause serious health problems to humans and animals, especially infants and pregnant people. Excess phosphorus in fresh water and excess nitrogen in coastal waters can cause increased plant growth and algal blooms. This reduces oxygen levels in the water and can have economic and health impacts. As animal waste is exposed to rain and snow, it can erode, that means gradually wear away, from a pasture. The waste can be transported by stormwater to surface water or groundwater where it has the potential to pollute the water system. There are many steps you can take to minimize water quality pollution risks. Take a look at our other manure manager videos to see the techniques and resources available for you to take these steps.